When I first realised that uh, I was losing my hearing, at first I was angry and I was slightly embarrassed. And this is so stupid because as we get older, bits of our body do start to malfunction and perform not as well as they used to when they were in their prime. But for some reason, hearing loss carries a stupid stigma. Cruel jokes are made about people. Oh, she's a bit mutton. Uh, you'll have to speak up. She's deaf. And I'm not deaf at all. It's just that certain elements of the higher register of my hearing have begun to fade. Now, it's a complete mystery as to why. Um, it could be because I used to listen to a lot of loud music. It could be because I used to dive. Um, and I've had quite a few serious ear infections from coral. It's not genetic. Neither of my siblings nor my child has it. So it's a mystery. And it's a mystery that I have to learn to live with. And um, I'm glad now that I've made the decision to be open about it because uh, when you deal with a problem, it makes it much easier to come to terms with. Well, you know, up until recently, hardly anybody except for my nearest and dearest have known. And the only time that I've found it really necessary to tell people is if I'm working in a rehearsal situation where the ambient sound in the room is bad and I've had problems hearing the director from far away um, or in musicals that I've been doing on stage where it's difficult to balance the sound of the hearing aid with the microphones. And recently when I've come clean about it, the most delightful response has been, yeah, and? You know, expecting people to go, oh my God! It isn't the reaction that you get, but I think that people feel that's the reaction they might get, and therefore they are uh, slow about telling the truth. There are an enormous amount of people out there, particularly in our business, particularly in the music business, with very severe loss. Nobody knows about it. If they were brave enough to come forward and admit it, then it might make it easier for other people to go and get their ears checked. The Sound Barrier Star Awards are run by Specsavers and by hearing dogs to recognise and laud people who have hearing problems or who are deaf um, for achieving extraordinary feats with their disabilities and their problems. Uh, this will be the third year and as often happens the universe has kindly rewarded me for um, being brave enough to say that I have hearing loss by giving me this um, opportunity of helping to raise awareness, helping hopefully people who might be embarrassed or frightened about admitting it and getting their hearing checked to do so. Maybe they might think, you know, if she can do it, I can do it. And also to raise awareness for this very worthwhile campaign because I think, you know, people who battle against any sort of odds deserve recognition.